how many lights, which lights, which light bulb. Like it's a whole process that I'm trying to figure out. Hello guys, it's Kristen. It's so great to see you again. I know it's been a minute, but there has been a lot going on, let's be honest. But I am here and ready to kick off the new year, even though it's February, but that's very like me. I'm fashionably late, so happy new year. So this year has been off to a super rainy start here in Los Angeles, which, mm, not gonna lie, has made it really difficult for a girl to find any motivation. But it looks like the sun's out and the water's dried up, so here we are, and I'm finally getting a little bit of time to explore my new downtown neighborhood. My mom was also just in town this past weekend, so together we did a lot of shopping for the new space, we did some painting, we did a couple of DIY projects, so all that is coming to you soon and I cannot wait to share. Oh, one more big announcement. I did find a little bit of time at the beginning of the year to update my site. I will post a link down in the description box below, so make sure you go there and sign up for the newsletter that will be coming out. It will be full of all kinds of goodies, so if you don't see me here, you will definitely see me in your inbox, because who doesn't want that? Okay, so let's get to it. One of the biggest problems that I have in this loft is the lack of light. No, not natural light. I get plenty of light during the day, but at nighttime, it's, it's dark, as it should be, but that's not how anybody wants to live. So I have recently been trying to just tackle this whole lighting situation so that when the sun goes down, I can still see what I'm doing. Now I've been obsessed with these pineapple lights. I know that you guys have seen them. Um, they're all over the place. They're really popular. I came across uh, a paper mache pineapple when I was shopping at my little craft store and I was like, boom, this is the perfect Ikea hack for my lamps that I got from Ikea and it's really simple and here's how you make a pineapple desk lamp. For this project you will need this lamp from Ikea, a paper mache pineapple, an X-Acto knife, a cutting board, glue, and spray paint. To start, you take your knife and cut open your paper mache pineapple. Don't cut it completely into two halves. I would just cut one side so that you have a nice way to slide the pineapple onto the base of your lamp. And once you've cut it, that is exactly what you're going to do. You're going to slide your pineapple onto the base of your lamp. Once your glue is dried, coat your pineapple lamp with spray paint in your favorite color. I just love this little project. I think it's kitschy, I think it's cute. I think it's a great way to dress up this really inexpensive lamp from Ikea. Adds a lot of personality to your space and people love it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you stay updated. There is a lot of paint slanging going on over here, a lot of end table making. Okay, so you just stay tuned because I'm really putting together, I think, a really nice uh, living space over here and I wanna share all my tips and tricks with you guys. So thank you again for watching and I'll see you next time.